Oh, just touch gloves. Come on. Come on. Come on. Two sculpted physiques, two big heavyweights. Lewis comes out attacking, lands a right, a jab. This is the most action that anybody's mounted against Lewis since Ray Mercer in 96. And there Briggs almost knocks the champion down. Shannon Briggs believing that he has hurt Lewis. Slug it and knock him out rather than setting his knockouts up. You get this guy a little courage, and you're going to have a fight on your hand. Good right hand over the top. He said it didn't hurt, but it did hurt. He's in the ringside seats of Briggs supporters. Good left hook by Briggs. Hard right hand over the top by Briggs. Briggs can't see Lewis's right hand over the top. Briggs missing. Briggs is going to waste a whole lot of energy shaking his head. Round four begins. Harold Letterman, how'd you score the first That was the left hook. Yep, Jim Utley, real quick, hook. two to one. Better hurry. Briggs has wobbled. Just as you said, George. I trained in training camp for right hands. You throw a left hook, you, you get him. Right hand lands flush for Lewis. Briggs. Every tick goes by is a tick in Shannon Briggs' favor. Yeah, but that wasn't in Shannon Briggs' favor. <laughs> Let's go to Well, work. the referee is a lot trying to gather himself. Hard left hand by Briggs. Lewis is hurt. And he comes back with his own left hook. And another right hand. And Briggs turns to our table to tell us that he's all landing flush with too many power punches just too much punishment air power punches and get his man out of there now when you have an opponent like Briggs and that will be it pro big Briggs crowd screaming for their man bravery for which Briggs is gonna pay well if you're in New York tonight you can be proud you know this guy has shown hey I'm just not a he slipped down that time. And that's all. Yeah. Good enough.